Welcome to Genoa Fincantieri Shipyard on board on Virgin Voyages Brilliant Lady. From the very beginning, Tate and Virgin Voyages have been in a partnership together to uh, implement most up-to-date automation technology in our venues. We really want to have a lot of immersive theatrical work and the company that we came to obviously would be Tate Towers for that. We have a lot of new technology from Tate, including the new Epic control system and IQ interface, along with obviously Navigator and running in the background across the entire fleet. We installed on board of Scarlet Ladyship One, the first Epic ever, and they are running two fly performance and the center point toys, two chandeliers, which are golden finished, but also with all the lighting that can change, so it can use also as a disco ball. In the red room specifically, it's a modular room. We have a, a seating bank, an automated seating bank on the stage itself and in the auditorium, so we can retract and expand that seating bank in the auditorium's floor space to allow us to reorganize the entire venue. It's what the future of theater is, is going towards its more immersive environment. For that to happen in a room space like that is fantastic. Six winches for the perform fly, five lifts on the stage, then we have seven LED trolleys that can traverse, rotate and raise lower. The manor venue itself, we have a floor space that we can transform as well, not as much as the red room, but we have a stage lift right in the centre of the performance space that we lower and we bring dinner show experience to our passengers on board. But at the same time, they have performer flying going overhead and we have performances happening on the stage floor and then they join themselves on the tables that are sitting for people to have their, their meals on and they, it's, it's all around there. Yeah. So a control engineer looks after the design and the installation of the control system of a uh, theatre in this case. Uh, right now we are in the MCR room, which is the room where we have installed one of the MCCs, which controls the fly performance winches. These performance flyers are BT winches. One encoder helps with the motion or controls the motion. The other one is for the safety. So we can uh, set up limits that can be quite easily tested, uh, reproduced or moved through software. And this is why we have equipped every single axis with a secondary safety encoder that tells us the exact position of the axis at every single moment during uh, operation. There are definitely challenges. We need to put two systems together, uh, but Tate has a big team. By working together, we always manage to achieve the results that we need. I like to be a control engineer, I really enjoy it because I get to use my brain and be ingenious. Having Epic on board all of our ships allows us to distribute our staff across all four ships and keep training within the company. With the IQ online courses, we can direct our staff to start learning before they get to the ship. Epic and IQ are becoming an industry standard for automation control. so. We have a lot of interest in people coming to work for this company. We have seven LED moving LED screens that are in our Red Room venue that had to be designed in order to withstand a ship that's constantly moving. We have performer flying winches, the BT winches overhead that need to be designed in order to keep in mind that the ship is going to move. So the engineering needs to be, needs to be exact. Having Epic and IQ on board um, allows us to make a lot of changes really quickly. It's a really simple interface. Um, for the automation system itself, so we can disable queues and we can um, we can skip over sections of, of the entire show that, that we know would be dangerous to do if the ship was rocking too much. Like any new system, there are issues um, and we've had our, our fair share of them, but with the partnership between Tate and Virgin Voyages, we've been able to report those issues um, and get people on them right away. This fleet of ships was one of the first clients that ever had Epic and IQ on board and we've worked together to make sure that the developments that have happened in IQ are beneficial to everybody. And so yeah, it's looking promising, it's looking promising and we're really excited to launch our fourth and final ship for now. Yeah, it's great, it's great to be working with you guys again. We are just one team and you know, you help this project from every side of the world, so thank you very much.